currently like 5 a.m. maybe 5 01. Um, I'm at the gym and I had this thought yesterday. So first of all, I haven't uploaded anything and it's, it's been raining and it's been cold out as of lately. So I haven't been able to do anything in regards to the lawn business, like the lawn care setup and whatever. But anyways, that's not what this video is about. Um, so I was thinking yesterday, I was just working, and I was like, am I really where I want to be right now? Like, is this what I want my life to be? Because for the past three weeks, four weeks, I've been doing the same thing. I get up at 4.20 in the morning, and I go to the gym, and then go to work, and then go home, like, clean or eat or whatever whatever I'm doing, and then bed, repeat. Same thing every day. Now, I like having the same schedule every day, but this isn't what I wanna do. Um, I, I really, really want to pursue a career in you know YouTube uh, and really want to push for that. And, um, there's a saying like you are where you are meant to be or you're where you are because of you so like really it's it's on me and I just wanted to spread the message like are you where you want to be just to kind of give somebody a wake-up call um, this is something that was just in my head and I was thinking about it and I can't stop thinking about it um, there's got to be something that I can do to get out of this. And I know there is. It's just, it's really just finding the sweet spot. Just finding the, um, finding the, the, the right path, the, the direction, you know. I don't know. Because uh, I don't want to be stuck in the position I'm in. And then 10, 20 years down the line, I'm like, oh, it's too late. And, you know, then I will never be able to do what I wanted to do with my life. Um, I don't think I'm meant to have a 9 to 5. And if you're an older person that's watching this, you're know, like, oh, you haven't worked enough to know what, uh, what it actually is to be working a 9 to 5 or whatever. Shut up. Okay, I've worked long enough to know what a nine to five is. Okay, but anyways, I don't want to be in a nine to five forever. All right, because uh, it's not, it's not permanent. Everybody learned that during the pandemic. Everybody learned that the nine to five you have or the job you have is not permanent. It's not secure. You can be fired. You know, let go, whatever, at any moment be replaced instantly they've got applications probably waiting for you to make a mistake so uh, my job isn't permanent I can be replaced today after I'm done with the gym here I can go to work and they're like hey uh, just grab your toolbox and get out so I don't want that to be the the factor that ruins my life like just because my job just lets me go because I'm not valuable enough or whatever um, and I don't want to be in that position I want to be I want to be in charge of what goes on in my life all the time and I should have that freedom and I should have that um, on my shoulder so um, for about a year and a half I had my lawn business and I was only doing that for a while and that is what it feels like to have your own like job and your own rules and you can do what you want and at that time super super nice I guess the really the only problem was just winter I can't do anything in the winter time so I didn't have a job in the winter um, but now, I just, I have a feeling that I can make it work. But 
I don't want to mess up, you know, I don't want to walk away excuse me, from what I have and pursue something and let's say it doesn't work. Uh, you know, but you have to take risks in life because that's the only way you're going to grow. That's the only way you're going to succeed. And that's the only way that you're going to learn. And I, like a year and a half ago when I just quit my job and went straight to lawn care, super beneficial for me. I learned a lot about one, owning your own business, a lot about what it takes to be your own boss, and a lot about discipline because you have to be very disciplined to make that work. And at the time, I'd say I'm a, I was a little less disciplined because now I'm very disciplined. And for the longest time, I couldn't make waking up at 4.20 in the morning possible because it was so difficult. And now it's become a habit. I do it, I have no problem waking up at this time, I have no problem getting to the gym, no problem working out in the mornings, I feel great. And um, it's all just, just keep doing it and eventually it'll just be in the back of your head and you won't have to think about it. Um, yeah, so if, if where you are right now in your life is what you want to do for the rest of your life, then just keep doing what you're doing. But if you don't want to be stuck doing what you're doing currently, then right now is your chance to fix it. Um, because you're only getting older, time is only going by faster, and you know, you're just running out of time pretty soon your window of opportunity will close and there'll be nothing you can do. Um, so I, I suggest, you know, just push for what you want to do. Just push for it because if, if you're looking for the perfect opportunity, you will never find it. But if you're looking for opportunities, then you'll find those, you know? So just push for opportunity after opportunity and really just stay disciplined and focused on what you want to achieve because this is your only chance at life and if it's not a life that you feel uh, if it's not a life that you are happy with you don't have another chance this is it so I really hope somebody takes something out of this it's like five in the morning so if, it, if I said anything that sounds weird my brain's still waking up so uh, just get up and move and really push for what you want to do in life um, because I'm sick of waiting and I'm sick of living the same thing over and over again I want a change and that change starts right now there's a, a saying I used to say to my buddies as a joke but it's a really um, it's a really good saying so it's like when's it goes like this when's the best time to plant a tree and then people will be like oh spring you know whatever and I'm like yesterday when's the second best time to plant a tree today so you didn't start yesterday, but luckily for you, the second best time to start that planting that tree is today. Because if you don't plant it, then it will never grow. So planting it right now, that's when it will start to grow. So yeah, so I guess the takeaway of this video, get out of your comfort zone, get out of whatever situation you're in and really push for something you want to do in your life because um, I'm done I'm sick of it so I really need to push myself and really need to just start putting priorities on top of my mundane tasks so um, that's all I have thanks for watching um, I hope 
if you found this informative or motivating, press that like button. If not, then thanks for watching.